that's how you set your limiter when it comes to saving yourself from clipping and blowing so that's just a short video so now that now that I showed you now that you can be able to do it as long as you know how to use the dry rack and know the relationship between clipping and limiting that's how you set it up you start off with a very good song all my EQs are flat and the reason why I would choose to do it to do it flat on the EQ without any bass or triple nothing applied to it whether it's a full range speakers or a sub it's because to me it's more advantageous when it comes to setting your limiters at the right time at the beat of the music don't use too much of a limiter like I said it's gonna act like a compressor and it's gonna take the dynamic away from the music it's gonna make it sound too pumpy and not enough volume it's best to have the clipping and the limiting work together like I said just turn it up a little bit until this until it turns red but have it blinking don't have it continuously because if you have it continuously before you adjust it you more likely to damage your voice your voice coil before you do any adjustment which is bad so just had a light flashing go back to whatever equipment you're using that has a limiter compressor such as a dry rack or any other system you use and just keep an eye on it as you adjust it so that way you can sync the clipping into limiting so that way you had the best performance the optimal performance instead of taking too much out which is fine but I'm the type of person I'm trying to get the best the best of the best out of my system some people tend to over compressor but like I said you're just gonna take away the dynamic so like I said play attention as you adjust the volume on your dry rack once you set the clipping point and just leave it right there to where the red light is blinking go back and adjust your limiter and leave your EQs and everything flat so once you sync that and let that work together then go back and add your EQs and the reason for that is because once you add EQs and everything to it you can never go over because the limiter is taken over so you can add as many bases you want mids or treble whatever but you can't hurt it because the limiter is taken over sorry about the phone I'm gonna go ahead and end this video and I'll holler at you later leave a comment below and let me know what's up so there you go Talk to you later.